drinks and appetizer to go around in this sponsored segment. Katie Sign shows us the coop in Layton for this week's Tasty Utah Bites. Take a look. Taste Utah Bites. Well, we have had an extraordinary time up here the last few weeks. We're at Roosters in Layton. We've been at the event space, and now we're at the Coop. Yeah. I'm sitting here with executive chef, operator, um, Matthew Lake. Chef, where is the Coop located? So the Coop, we're in the same building as Roosters and Layton, which a lot of people in the area are familiar with, off Heritage Park Boulevard right here next to the Convention Center. Okay. And uh, there was a restaurant formerly here. Okay. And we had the opportunity to expand for the event spaces that we saw. And we decided we had the opportunity to put a bar in, 21 and over, slightly elevated, big whiskey cocktail, craft cocktail list. Okay. Uh, different than Roosters, trying to complement. So food's um, a lot of things meant to be shared. Love it. Um, so yeah, for very example, seasonally driven, you know, everything made in house. We make everything in house for all the restaurants, but yeah. really a lot of seasonal driven. This menu will change rapid and often. Oh, that's so fun. And so. that's kind of what's nice. It's a it's a bar style menu, so it's a, probably a smaller menu. Yeah, smaller menu than the brew pub for sure. Yeah, yeah, absolutely, which is so exciting. We were talking to Kim a couple of weeks ago just about the consistency that Roosters is known for. The Coop is bringing that exact same vibe, a little bit of elevated cuisine. Yeah, a little bit of elevation. Well, you know, we like to say nice, not fancy, right? Just comfortable yeah. and nice and fun. And uh, so far, it's been great. Oh, I love that. And and this um, remodeled space here is beautiful. You've got the bar when you walk in and then you sort of have like a covered patio. But then even this beautiful space back behind yeah, the, the kitchen. Yeah, the back room. Yeah, the, the sunroom. So um, we have, it's it's really great. When the place is hopping on the weekend nights, it's interesting because, you know, obviously around the bar it gets crowded, but we have groups that hang out in the back and it, it's a really comfortable space. It's so nice. I love it. It's so inviting. Um, speaking of inviting, this food is inviting me to want to take bites of it. <laughs> what Please is do. better in the middle of the afternoon or evening than what looks like hand cut fresh potato chips? They are. We fry them to order. We make them, you know, cut them ourselves, fry them to order. So this is our chips and dip. Oh my gosh. And, I've got to uh, get them on this. What's yeah, the this dip? is the dip is a um, black garlic dip. It's got a so lot of different good. things in it, but it's our own. It's a black garlic dip, and uh, very popular. And you know, great to come in and just sit and have a couple of beers These and share some chips yeah. or order more plates. I mean, the coop is really about just being flexible and doing whatever you want. Mm. In the middle of the day, you want to come in and have a drink and some chips. Great. Love it. You want to make a full dinner. We have, you know, larger plates as well as the smaller ones. Um, if you wanted to share a bunch of things, which yeah. is what I love to do, because I think that's the most fun. Same way. And uh, and I'm just going to get into these, but these look like arancinis if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, those, so those are our risotto fritters. So okay. uh, Parmesan, of course, and Asiago risotto. Oh, yeah. A little bit of truffle. Yeah. And our roasted tomato sauce. Yum. And then in front of you. These are our chorizo meatballs, and they're done with, they're finished with a little bit of a sherry cream. Mm. And they're also very popular. Again, you could easily make a meal out of two of these yep. plates for yourself. You could share a bunch of things. Or, like I said, we do have some of the bigger plates too that are okay. more like the Wagyu burger and things oh, like that. Oh, some yeah. heartier dishes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. some heartier, mm -hmm. bigger dishes. We've got some well. beautiful uh, beverages in front of us. Talk to Yeah, so you've got the Moff Sky. Okay. And I've just got a dressed beer. So, this is our IPA. We just dressed it with a little bit oh, of chili and lime. I love it. Because I'm a big fan of that. A little so. bit of spice, which is so nice. Yeah. And um, when you say just a beer, it's probably... Well, it's our, yeah. I shouldn't say that, not just a beer. So it is, uh, this is our uh, Rooster's uh, Hazy IPA. Because what's really cool about the Coop, too, is that you're featuring collaborations and you're also featuring yes. other breweries. Yeah, so we try to keep, because, you know, Rooster's right next door. We have, obviously, all everything that we brew ourselves. Yes. And we took this opportunity with Coop. We keep about four handles. We have 12 handles on draft. Nice. We keep four handles for Roosters, and then the other ones, everyone from Wasatch Fisher Brewing. Uh, we try to get the other local breweries and that. feature them in. You're rotating so, community, and that's yeah. what Roosters really has always been about. The Coop is now just exemplifying that also. I mean, I have to say, when we visited the B Street Brewery and sort of that entire operation over there, it was so special to see yeah. all that you're bringing to, not just the Ogden community, but the Utah restaurant community, and letting people sample the Utah restaurant community through the beverages that you make. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, yeah it's, it's a lot of fun. And I, I love going to the brewery. I mean, we do, it's fascinating. And if you've never 
Uh, we brew still in each store, so yeah. that's something we're super proud of. So like right next door at Roosters, we yeah. still have a full functioning brewer on site brewing beer you're, for you're, this location. Yeah. Our Ogden location still has a brewery in it as well as B Street with the where the that's where the majority of like our distribution for yeah. cans and things is. Absolutely, which is brewed. so so special. Yeah. I mean you'll want to check out the coop roosters and Layton. Also taste Utah every Sunday, 9 30 a.m. We're making dining the destination. We know you want to join us. See you on Sunday. Oh, thank you to Taste Utah for that sponsored interview.